This is Financial Independence with Colin Richards. Colin is president and founder of Lord & Richards, a team of advisors dedicated to helping you achieve the retirement of your dreams. Get ready to discover how you can live well, retire well, and invest well in today's volatile world. Time now for Financial Independence. Hey folks, Colin Richards here. I'm your retirement advisor, and I want to welcome you to another great episode of the Lord & Richards Show. Today, we've got a fascinating topic. We're going to be continuing our discussion of smart women and smart retirement for women. Uh, We started this a couple weeks ago, and really, it's based upon my friend and number one best-selling New York Times author, David Bach. Uh, Nine times over New York Times best-selling author, David Bach. And I'm very excited that we now offer, as part of the Lord & Richards team, seminars and workshops just for women. So today that's our topic, but you know, every single week we get together here on the radio program and we talk about methods and strategies that are going to help you, whether you're a lady or whether you're a man, to prosper through both good times and bad. And we do that from a biblical principle perspective perspective. And so I'd love to chat with you. My team and I would love to talk to you about any specific questions you have about retirement, living well, retiring well. We offer a complimentary second opinion. Just give us a call at this number. Here you go, 720-636-8861. And while you're at it, you can find out about a workshop that may be held in your area. Here's that number one more time for your complimentary second opinion visit, 720 720- 636-8861. So let's dive into smart women and smart retirement part two. And today we're going to pick up where we left off. Now, last time, just by way of review, we talked about the incredible economic powerhouse that women have become owning over 10 million businesses. That is more than 20 times as many businesses as women owned back in 1975. Great job, ladies. Way to go. of households with assets over $600,000 are already controlled by women today. And 83% of purchases are controlled by women. So ladies, you have a huge voice and we want you to be heard. Now there's some negatives, and we talked about this last time. Uh, A lot of the time, for those of you who are ladies, realize that the average age of widowhood is 59. 59. So women are living longer, and therefore, if you're married... Your husband may never know if the plan actually worked. So you've got to get in front of this, okay? you got to get him and you into our offices or into one of our classes and start learning how you can be prepared in case you're one of the majority of women who actually outlive your husband. And then we talked about how to put money in line with your values. So important. What's important in your life? The goals, those are the tangible things, like I want to go on a trip. I want to build an addition to our home. The values, that's the intangibles. That's the desires that you have. I'd love to be more with my family, with my grandkids, with my daughter, my son, my husband, whatever it is. And a lot of times these are drastically different than what, if you're married, a man might have said. Okay, ladies, you have different goals, different values. It comes across quite a bit different. So what we really want to do is make sure that your financial well-being is tied to your values and not just somebody else's outside view of how your money should be set up and invested as you prepare for retirement. And that really is important. So today we're going to pick up where we left off last time, and we're going to talk about Dave's three-basket approach. Now, Dave's been on Oprah. He's been all over the media. He's talked about this. But you know what? You may not have picked that up. And so I'm going to talk to you today. What does David Bach mean in his book when he talks about the retirement basket and these other baskets, such as the security basket and the dream basket? Three baskets that make up the best approach, ladies, heading into your future retirement year. So what kind of problems are we going to solve in this retirement basket. Well, we got to solve a lot of problems, right? We got to deal with income. We got to solve the social security issue, taxes, uh, your risk. You know, how much risk are you willing to take? All of these are important and the list can go on and on and on. But out of all the things we could put there as things we need to take care of in the retirement basket, guess what the number one item is? The number one item is 
in order to get retired and stay retired, ladies, you got to have a paycheck, right? When you stop working, do you still need that? Absolutely. And what we see is in the financial service industry, the advice focuses on the product. You know, it's important to have this stock or to have this tool or this mutual fund, whatever it is. But folks, what really matters on the other side of the tool is the income that allows you to achieve the values, right? So we've got what's important in life. That's your values. We got the tools and what connects the two is income. Now, Social Security is going to be a key piece of that income. This is very personal. Now, listen, you may have looked up a calculator. The calculator's fine on the Social Security website. Uh, my good friend, Dr. Lawrence Kotlikoff, has got a great calculator for thorny situations. But here's the reality. If everything just works out with no variables whatsoever, all of the different options kind of look the same if you're a single, right? You can retire at 62, take your Social Security, and if you live the same amount as the guy who took it at 70, you'll get about the same size, um, or pardon me, the same amount of money out of the system. But it's not always that simple. It's a very personal story. And if you're just jumping in, we're talking about smart women and how to have a smart retirement. Now, these principles, by the way, apply to men as well as women, but there are some very unique issues, ladies, that are just for you that we're talking about today. And so if you're just tuning in, this is the Lord and Richards Show. I'm Colin Richards, president and founder, and I'm thrilled to lead a team of advisors here in the Denver area that help clients all over the country, from Florida all the way to Hawaii. And you know, one of the things that we would love to do for you is take you through our simple three-step financial independence review. This is where you come in, share your goals and your dreams, let us know really what's important to you, and then we test your portfolio. We take your portfolio and we package it up, put it in a time capsule, go back uh, a dozen years or 20 years, and we relive history. Guess what? That's a smart way to do it because we can relive some of the best and the worst of times, and we can tell you how well prepared you are. Come on in and get your simple three-step financial independence review. There's absolutely no cost to you, but it's an opportunity to sit down with a skilled financial professional, talk through your retirement concerns, your goals for financial independence, and see if you're on track. Here's the phone number, 720-636-8861. Just give us a call, 720-636-8861, and let's chat. So we're talking about smart women in retirement, and we're talking about the first basket in what we call the three-basket approach. This is based on David Bach's system, his smart women system for ladies. And I love this, you know, because inside this retirement basket, we've got income that we've got to take care of from your portfolio. We've got income from your Social Security. Potentially, you've got income from pensions. Now, here's critical. If you're married and your husband has a pension, you know, usually there's option A, B, C, so forth, right? An opportunity to take different dollar amounts out of that pension when you retire. And guess what guys do? They just grab option A because it's more money, right? But if your husband picks option A, ladies, it dies with him. And it's an irreversible decision. Nine times out of 10, in the situations I see, it's far better to pick one of the other options where there's a joint benefit available to you. Now, if you're single, no problem. Confidently, boldly take option A and get all the money that you can out of that. Retirement plans have to be addressed in the retirement basket, right? Your 401ks, your 403bs, your IRAs. Most people have these. Do you have more than one? Yeah, a lot of times we just call it a big mess, right? Because because we're not 100% sure between you and if you're married, your spouse, where all these accounts are. Here's some critical things. Do you know where they are? What do you do with them? Well, you probably need to roll those over because that way you can consolidate and simplify your financial situation into an IRA because 401ks aren't great sources of income, are they? Yeah, how do I take money out of 401k? Random withdrawals. They're not income generators. So you got to figure out how to get a paycheck out of them. And again, ladies, if you're married, you got to know, hey, how on top of this is my husband? And has he set this up properly so that if he dies before me, I don't have to jump through too many hoops? Because right now, you got to figure out if he passes away, where are they? How do you get them transferred to you? And you got to go talk to the people that he works with that may not know you personally or the benefits people at his company. 
You got to get the death certificate, prove that you're the beneficiary, make sure it's you and maybe not an ex-spouse. And then you're told, well, do you want to send this to a spousal or to a beneficiary IRA? What, what do you do next? Those are important questions. Get on the front end of it, ladies, and get it over into an IRA as soon as it is eligible, either for an in-service rollover while he's working or when he retires. No taxable event takes place. You've got more investment options available to you, and it's much easier to create a paycheck for life out of that. And guess what? It's simpler. It's consolidated. And on death, you just hand a death certificate to us and we take care of it for you. So the retirement basket has all these different issues. When we sit down, we got to solve for the income gap. You say, what's an income gap? That's the difference between the amount of income you get from Social Security, pensions, and other guaranteed income sources, and what you actually need to live on. And folks, it's not that simple to solve for this. We use financial science at Lord & Richards. And if that's you, if you say, yeah, I'd like a little bit of science because I want to make sure I cover that income gap and I don't run out of money before I run out of life, then it's time to pick up the phone once again and give us a call at 720-636-8861. Again, that's 720-636-8861. And let us know, hey, I'd like to have that complimentary financial independence review. I'd like somebody to solve for my income gap using science. Here it is one more time, 720-636-8861. And we'll be right back after this. Hey folks, this is Colin Richards, founder of Lord & Richards. We're your Social Security and Retirement Advisors. Are you concerned about taking the next step of retirement by filing for Social Security at the right time? Did you know there's over 567 different ways to claim? And claiming at the wrong time could cost you and your family hundreds of thousands of dollars over your lifetime. Recent changes in the Social Security system have made things even more difficult for retirees, but we can help. Right now, we're opening registration for you to come to our next live Social Security and Retirement Workshop, where we can help you get the most out of Social Security. Give us a call at Lord & Richards, 720-686-2996. That's 720-686-2996. 2996 or learn more at lordandrichards.com. Investment advisory services offered only by duly registered individuals through AE Wealth Management LLC. Our firm is not affiliated with the U.S. government or any governmental agency. Hey, folks, welcome back. This is Colin Richards of Lord and Richards. You're listening to the Lord and Richards Show, and today we are talking especially to the ladies. Ladies, welcome back. We're talking about smart women, smart retirement. Where we left off in the last segment, we were talking about the need to deal with this first of three baskets, the retirement basket. And one of the things we're talking about is the income gap. You know, you don't want a hope and a prayer financial plan when it comes to retirement. You need a trust but verify, right? That's where we use science to predict your likelihood of success in retirement. We can actually put a percentage on it, running thousands of simulations. We can determine through good markets, bad markets, ugly markets, beautiful markets, through all kinds of things that life throws at at you from health crises to nursing home, whether you've got enough money to make sure you never run out of money before you run out of life. If that's you and you say, yeah, I need that kind of a complimentary review. I need that kind of testing on my portfolio. Then just think of my friend, Dave. My friend Dave's wife called me up and she said, man, I'm really concerned. My husband is canceling his life policy and we're not retired yet. I said, boy, what does your financial planner say? They didn't have one. I said, well, what is the purpose of this? And in the end, what we realized is, you know, they didn't have a financial plan. And before they could make a critical decision about whether or not he should keep his life insurance, we had to figure out if we could solve for his income gap. We had to figure out, you know, what was the taxability of the portfolio? What is the best way to take Social Security? All of this. So, so much better. As we switch from the accumulation mindset of our working years, where it's kind of, eh, I'm not too concerned about that statement sitting over there. Maybe I won't even open the envelope. To now we're in our distribution or our spending years where that money has got to be stretched like taffy over an entire lifetime. And then finally, a retirement plan in this retirement basket needs to be put in place. Where's the money? You know, in our first visit, we call it a discovery meeting. We get 
your money in front of you all in one place. We help you organize that. We figure out where the income's coming from and develop a custom plan. And then we figure out how long it'll last. We actually stress test this baby. Yeah, we throw it against the wall like those old commercials with the crash dummy guys, right? So we'll test you for risk, for inflation, for taxes, for long-term care. Did you know that a person with a $250,000 IRA who lives a normal life expectancy starting in their 60s will likely end up paying $350,000 in taxes over their lifetime and into the next generation? That's more than the IRA. And what about health care? What if you or your loved one need care? 70% of the people I sit in front of are going to need serious amounts of care. That's called long-term care. It's the number one cause of bankruptcy. Do you have a plan, a written plan, to make sure that you're prepared in the event of a healthcare emergency and you're not bankrupted by it? This all has to be in writing, folks. It needs to be a clear, well-thought-out plan. And I tell you what, that's why we've made the decision at Lord & Richards to be specialists in retirement. Whether we're talking to men or ladies, it's like a relay race, right? We take the baton from here. Maybe your current guy has gotten you down the road. His mindset was accumulation, but it's a whole different ballgame. It's like moving from addition and subtraction to calculus when it comes time to retire, and you don't want to get that calculation wrong. So what other baskets of the three do we have to deal with? Well, the next basket we call the security basket. It's kind of the what if basket. You know, if you're married, ladies, do you need to know anything about the money? What do you think? (laughs) My ladies' uh, clients tell me we want to know everything. So that's why when we sit down with you, we always plan as a team. We sit down together, husband, wife. If you're single, you've still got to know everything, and you got to have it organized for those who love you. We're not talking the kitchen drawer approach, right? You ever looking for that screwdriver or maybe that uh, pen, and it's in the dreaded kitchen drawer. (laughs) Well, the other day we had a client who had a kitchen drawer kind of portfolio. One of our advisors in running our stress test entered 300 different investment positions into our scientific software. Wow. You need some help. We need a couple of file systems and inventory worksheets that we've got available. They come right out of David's workbook, David Box workbook from the Smart Women Finish Rich book. I heard a story just a couple weeks ago of a gentleman in my church who had had a situation where a family member died without a will. It was a disaster for the family, especially the kids that were left behind in school. Are your beneficiaries up to date, especially folks if you were remarried at one point? Like I told you, my friend Dave was thinking about canceling his insurance. Should you, or do you need more? We don't know until we run a plan. So a comprehensive plan is something that a specialist can do for you in retirement that a generalist just doesn't and can't do. At a recent advisory event, I was surrounded by financial advisors. So I thought, oh man, all these guys probably do what I do. Another guy talks to me and asks a little bit about our practice. And he said, oh, you're one of those guys that does everything. Well, folks, we don't want to be jack of all trade and master of none, but we really are a specialist when it comes to everything that has to do with retirement, right? Now let's talk about our third and final basket. If you're just joining us, this is Colin Richards. I'm Denver's retirement advisor. I lead a gifted team, a wonderful team of caring and compassionate advisors, all coming from a biblical perspective when it comes to finance, principles that are timeless, and we want to help you be better prepared for retirement, especially you ladies. We're talking to you today. So I'd like you to grab the scratch pad and write this number out. Here you go. 720-636-8888. 6-1-7-2-0-6-3-6-8-8-6-1. Sign up for our upcoming Smart Women, Smart Retirement Ladies Seminar, or sign up for our Social Security Workshop or our Taxes in Retirement Workshop. They're all complimentary. There's no cost to you. It's an opportunity to sit down and learn more and be better prepared and equipped for retirement. Well, the third basket is my favorite. We have our retirement basket. We have our security basket or our what-if basket. And then the third basket it's our dream basket, folks. This is the work hard, play hard, right? What kind of things do you have in your security basket? Well, my friend David Bach puts it this way, you know, return on investment, ROI, that's a term that gets thrown around by financial professionals. But guess what we like? At Lord & Richards, we like ROR. That's return on retirement. Yeah. But you know what? The good news is 
we can help you with that. You know, one of the worst things that can happen is to sit down with some financial person and and dread them telling you, you know what, I don't think you're going to make it. <laughs> you need to cut back. You need, well, that's not what we're looking for. Our goal at Lord & Rich is to help you figure out how to not only retire, but to retire well, to retire financially independent. If you're just joining us, this is Colin Richards, president and founder of Lord & Richards. We're talking to our ladies today about how to be a smart woman in retirement. Based on my friend David Bach's number one bestseller, Smart Women Finish Rich, and his workbook and workshop that we conduct here in Denver, Smart Women, Smart Retirement. Our goal is to help you as ladies empower yourselves to take control of your retirement future. One of the things that we love to do is sit down with you right in the comfort of our offices and learn more about your goals, your dreams. It's completely complimentary. It's an opportunity for you to share what's important to you and then get some great advice. One of the things we do in that is we conduct a complete risk review. We call it a financial independence review. We test out the risk in your investments to see if you're caring too much for what you want to achieve in life. That's real important. Then we do an income and expense analysis where we detect your likelihood of success. If you retire today or tomorrow or at 65, what really is your likelihood as a percentage of success? Is it 99% that you'll make it and not run out of money? Is it 50%? Do you think that's good to know? We throw everything at it. Good markets, bad markets, everything in between. And then we do a healthcare analysis to make sure you're prepared. If one of you, if you're married or if you get sick, we want to make sure you're prepared economically to stay independent and not have to rely on others to foot your bill. And then a tax and legacy analysis. That's an opportunity to make sure we're not leaving the best of what we've accumulated over the years to the government, but rather to those we love and to charities and to churches and to other things that are worthy. So this we call a financial independence review, and it just means picking up the phone and giving us a call at 720-636-8861. Again, that's 720-636-8861. Or of course, check us out online at lordandrichards.com. So now we come to the final little piece. We've gotten through our retirement basket, our what if, or our security basket, and then our dream basket. And here's how I want you to view it. There are really three major stages in retirement. The first we call the go-go years. From the time you retire on into your early 70s, this is a period when you have time affluence. Lots of time. You've got your health. Your grandkids want to be with you, right? This is a great time to enjoy life. This is when you should be taking the trips. So one of the things we don't do at Lord & Richards is make you hold on to your money for somebody else. If you want to go, go, <laughs> okay? If Social Security is important to help that happen, we might even have you take that check earlier. Why? Because the next stage is slower go. That means it's maybe not as easy to get around. I had a client recently, or actually it was a couple of years ago, that really wanted to buy a wonderful little car, a little convertible. I said, of course, go do it. It's time. And she enjoyed that car. And then she had an accident where somebody else struck her. It wasn't her fault. But that really slowed her down. And folks, whether it's health or life or other circumstances, the slower go years are still great times, but we're not going to have as much that we can do when we start to slow down physically. And then we have what we call the won't go. Now, this doesn't mean you won't go. It just means if you're married, your husband probably doesn't feel like going, you know? <laughs> so maybe you're in your late 70s, early 80s, and he just wants to stay at home and watch the game, right? Uh, David Bach told me about how his mom just took an African safari at age 76, but dad wasn't going on that safari. <laughs> So let's focus on those three stages, and especially if you're nearing retirement, think about, hey, how am I going to enjoy my go-go years? And here's the goal. Enjoy it. Live it up. And for those of us who are Christians, find ways that you can make an impact and a difference in this world for Christ. That's what it's all about in the end. Well, we come to the end of our time, but I just want to say how much I've enjoyed talking to you ladies today about smart women and smart retiring. You are empowered. You have what it takes. It's just a matter of getting the hand-holding and a little bit of help, and you'll be well on your way. Here's my suggestion. Pick up the phone and talk to us, 720-636-8861. We'll give you a complimentary financial independence review. You'll know where you stand, and you'll be better organized than you ever thought. Here's the number again, 720-636-8861. Thank you so much for joining me today. 
The content of today's program is based on the number one best-selling book by nine-time New York Times best-selling author David Bach. David Bach does not endorse the individuals presenting Smart Women, Smart Retirement. As a co-founder and part owner of AE Wealth Management, Mr. Bach may be remunerated for an advisor's use of this presentation and may financially benefit from any future investment advisory relationship between you and the presenter. Investment advisory services offered only by duly registered individuals through AE Wealth Management, LLC. AE Wealth Management and Lauren Richards are not affiliated companies. Investing involves risk, including the potential loss of principal. Any references to protection, safety, or lifetime income generally refer to fixed insurance products, never securities or investments. Insurance guarantees are backed by the financial strength and claims payment abilities of the issuing carrier. This radio show is intended for informational purposes only. It is not intended to be used as the sole basis for financial decisions, nor should it be construed as advice designed to meet the particular needs of an individual's situation. Lord and Richards is not permitted to offer, and no statement made during this show shall constitute tax or legal advice. Our firm is not affiliated with or endorsed by the U.S. government or any governmental agency. The information and opinions contained herein provided by third parties have been obtained from sources believed to be reliable, but accuracy and completeness cannot be guaranteed by Lord and Richards.